name is pankaj and now we should learn a few concept based questions of algebra this is a word problem from quadratic equations this is less of concept based but more you can take it as a revision sum for you how to approach a word problem right so let's do that the sum is for a real number 6 times of the number equals its square find the required numbers right so let the number be x always in quadratic or linear the first thing is the assumption statement the most important right you should start you should not just keep thinking about the word problem let's start let's start with the assumption statement because the question is find the required numbers let the required number be x right now the question is 6 times of the number equals its square the number is x so 6 times the number 6x equals is equal to its square whose square number square that is x square right so as simple as the equation is 6x is equal to x square right you get 6x is equal to x square or x square is equal to 6x one and the same solve it one important thing is don't directly cancel this x and x you can't do that remember that right because x can also be equal to 0 right and if you cancel x and x that is basically you are dividing by x that is if x is 0 then you cannot divide by 0 so always this is one thing which you should know in this sum don't cancel this x and x directly write it in the form of quadratic equation x square minus 6x is equal to 0 In one of the previous concept based sums we saw how to solve an equation involving only a x square term and an x term. What do we do? We take the common, right? We take x as common. Bracket it is x minus 6 is equal to 0. You get x is equal to 0 or x minus 6 is equal to 0, so x is equal to 6. You remember uh, in the concept itself we studied that whenever the equation in the form where there is a square term and there is an x term one of the roots will always be equal to 0 right so the required numbers are 0 and 6